Hey guys, it's Matthew here once again with the uh, end game update on the Perforate Champion, um, Savior, Impale, whatever character. And uh, I mean, it's mostly good news. Uh, a little bit of bad news is that we're melee. Uh, the good news is that the build uh, performed pretty well in the end. Uh, so yeah, didn't really even crack 4k life because I was just trying to prioritize a bit more other fun shit on the tree the mark passives and all that, but could definitely go above 4k life if you really wanted to on a build like this. But uh, Perforate itself held up pretty well, Champion held up pretty well, um, and I tried out a bunch of uber content and some um, regular content as well. And um, the good news is that it, yeah, Champion with these types of defenses, good evasion, good armor, um, bit of life gain on hit, and good DPS even with an Abyssus, holds up really well in most of the content in the game. Uh, like 20, 30 million DPS, some shit like that, and uh, we run around steamrolling almost everything, uh, and regular bosses like Maven, Shaper, Uber Elder, that sort of shit. Very cruisy, very easy, you can go through invites pretty quick, it's all good shit. And this also delivered my first uh, Wave 30 Simulacrum for the League, which was a bit surprising, because like I said, Abyssus and my damage isn't that overwhelming for a you know, Simulacrum. Um, and as well as that, my life pull isn't that high, and I'm also not ailment immune. So a lot of those things come together to make Simulacrums a bit harder, but overall died a couple times on Simulacrum and then end up f finishing up wave 30, which uh, was, yeah, pretty damn good. So I don't have to worry about doing that again, but we'll probably challenge some other characters as well. Uh, the bad news, even though the DPS is pretty damn good like I'm honestly very happy with my um, damage throughout the proper end game um, boss fights it still isn't quite enough to trivialize ubers um, in a way that you'd like to as melee so you either have to build like really sort of sustained so this is just a regular maven for example um, which yeah like I said trivializes this shit um, for ubers though you really have to either have like two to three times my current damage which is really hard to do, uh, or be a bit, like, much more tankier and well-rounded while still maintaining some decent DPS. So if I could have, like, a bit more defense, uh, a bit more life in my build, some regen, similar DPS, and no Abyssus, then I could probably take on a lot of the Ubers um, a bit more reliably. I'm not quite sure how I'd be doing that with a lot of um, melee builds and sort of hipster skills here or there, uh, but I guess maybe it's possible. Because uh, otherwise, yeah, the rest of the normal content out here, really easy, but the Uber content, it was frustratingly painful as a melee character. Uh, let me just convey that to you right now. The rest of the game I was having a good amount of time with. When I was doing the Uber attempts, I was just taking punishment uh, because there are so few times like, we all knew it right we all knew exactly what it would be like when we saw it and when we experienced it but there is just yeah so few opportunities for you to attack some of these bosses when you've got to do the other mechanics when you've got to avoid the other mechanics and then once they're doing like their phases and shit um, and then you've got to ramp your character, maybe you're not at maximum DPS immediately, etc. It just, it is frustrating how little uptime you get compared to something like the Storm Rain I just played, which is a much squishier character, has probably a bit more DPS, yeah, let's say a, a bit more DPS by far. A bit more by far, yes, that's what I meant to say. Um, anyway. But uh, Ubers are much, much easier on that character because you can just like always attack pretty much wherever you are uh, and just do a few little mechanics every now and again whereas with this you have to like dodge a bunch of mechanics and then get your dps in and as well as that if you know the maven and the shaper if you start bricking your arena uh, because you have to place things wherever conveniently and get back into the fight if you end up bricking your arena it's pretty much fucking over you can't do anything beyond that point <laughs> Uh, even remotely bricking so with this like it took me two or three mavens to kill uber maven because um, I get caught out you make a mistake and then one ball goes in the wrong spot for degen puddles and then it's really hard to like 
recover from that as a melee sort of build and uh yeah this it took two or three goes for a maven to die it's it's doable it's a bit more of a methodical fight than some of the others but uh still it's very quite rough on the melee because you very rarely get to um actually attack while doing the um mechanics and then just on top of that yeah uh even when you do actually get to get in there maybe you're not fully ramped and you're in danger and all kinds of shit like i said wearing an abyss doesn't help for a lot of these um mechanics though for the proper ubers for example maven does have a few extra things cirrus in particular um the degen puddles and his damage over time shit like the storms and all that amplify like through your abyssus infinitely so all of my extra defenses basically mean nothing against these degen puddles whereas abyssus makes taking damage from these degen puddles literally not possible you can't like touch it for the splittest of seconds and uh yeah ubiceris was just straight up not happening i threw one away just just to lean into some more tilt because i felt like it um but otherwise not happening uh the wave 25 to 30 simulacrum is what you're seeing here i think this is wave 26 or some shit um this is all pretty comfy like having a good amount of evasion while having some good damage reduction uh is really nice for simulacrum because you barely ever need to take hits here or you barely ever take hits and then the ones that you do you recover from fairly quickly uh being element immune would have been very big but uh yeah in general i think champions are going to be a pretty good sort of defense base and character for simulacrums uh so overall it's good news like if you want to just play the game normally which you probably should be doing because uber is a very aspirational content then a melee build perforate still pretty good if you want to do some ubers you probably want to find something else either way you can now watch my maven kill with all its frustrations in full if you really want to i was a bit tilted by the end of the video thank you very much for watching see you guys next time can't make mistakes then you just get like uber punished like it just keeps escalating to the point where My spirits are spent. Do what I say. It's irrecoverable. Stand still. Hmm, not the best start there. I already had to place a ball kind of outside the zone you want to be in. Pain will be returned tenfold. I think I think what's actually killing me a few times, you know, more than I'd like is the fact that I'm not fully capped. On suppress. Like, I'm relying on the flask for the last 10%, and I think a few Cascade of Pains that killed me just ended up hitting that 10%. And that's just like... not on. It's gotta be a full cap. On a stack. Or something. That is just unethical. That was rapid fire. I can't do this just yet. Oh my god, dude. Am I allowed to do some fucking damage? No? Holy fuck, that's annoying. didn't realize that was the wrong thing. Fucking hard to pay attention when you got to focus on the other shit. I thought I paid enough attention, but nope, got it wrong. Stand still. Whoa, 
resistance. Well, so far I only mostly want to read one side they're in is fucked, so. You know. Recoverable. Sky. Sky. Just gonna try and farm some. Uh, I agree with Mathful. Flasks right now. I think the next is 10 left reserve. Got to ask, what's the uh, thought process of people that resub during these fights? Do you just see a button pop up and go, okay, or you know, without thinking about it at all, or do you go, hey, I'm going to try and fuck him over? What is it? What are you thinking about when you're doing that? If, if I may ask. <laughs> not the biggest deal. It's not super distracting, but it's more than nothing. <laughs> Uh, was this just back and forth? Oh, thank God. Do what I say. I can't survive this, can I? Oh, okay, a little bit. Oh, that's good. Stop resisting. Reality bends. This is actually probably the best I've been set up so far for the last Maven phase. So it's still not good, but it's better than the previous two, I think. C button, click button, maybe. I'd say if I can't do it from here, it's more my fault at this point. So this is this should be a skill-based finish. Scurry, Not a scurry. good sequence here though. Like any sequence is gonna involve going up and back through that puddle area. It's pretty far. Like, for fuck's sake. It's just about getting greedy there, because I haven't had a chance to attack her yet. I really wanted to go in. I'm like, eh, I can probably go this way and fucking ditch. How dead am I? I'm dead. up time. I wasn't convinced I could, so I didn't really press too much. Please just go up and back. Pretty frustrating how little you get to attack as melee. Dodge this, dodge this, dodge this, dodge this. Okay, one second window and she poofs. I don't think I can do this. This phase, that is. Was it not bad? But it was back after that, man. Come on.
Just two circles, badass dude. Take this. I can't do this just yet. Spent. Do what I say. Stand still. Required. Fuck this game, man. I swear, dude, playing melee makes you want to quit. Don't do it. Don't fucking do it. Enjoy the game with a build instead, a real build. I mean, I'm just talking about Ubisoft, really. If you're doing normal content, mapping and regular bit, um, bossing, it's not too bad. Otherwise, get a melee build that's got a bajillion damage. Otherwise, don't fucking do it. No one told me all this shit, dude. No one told me! This was a science experiment. Some people spend 10k on a mobile game for science, some people roll a melee character. They're roughly on equivalent levels of pain.